My name is Ryan Jackson and I'm the William S. Perper Director of Music and Fine Arts Ministries here at Fifth Avenue Presbyterian Church. I grew up in a small town in Canada, about 150 miles north of Toronto, called Bracebridge. And so during my early years growing up, I was a member of the junior choir at that church. And that's where I was first exposed to the pipe organ and choral music and all of that. And my mom tells me I was obsessed with it from, from the very earliest age. I think it was in me from the very beginning to be a musician. I went to school at the University of Toronto, I did my undergrad there, and then I came down to the US to do grad school and I started out at Yale University in New Haven, and then I moved to New York to do my doctorate at the Juilliard School. Well, I'm currently in my 12th season as music director and it's just been an amazing fit for me musically, liturgically, theologically. You know, the great St. Augustine actually said that singing is praying twice, and that's definitely the case for me. And one of my favorite things about planning a worship service here at the church is to think about the whole worship service from start to finish and think about how all these musical elements interact with each other and with the spoken parts of the service. What kind of atmosphere are we trying to create? Is it a festive Sunday? Is it a solemn Sunday? So all of these elements just allow for endless creativity in planning a worship service and the musical components for it. When I started at Fifth Avenue, you know, I came into this beautiful space, Kirkland Chapel here, and I thought, this place needs to have a concert series. You know, and that combined with the fact that the church just has this amazing, amazing choir world-class you know these singers are just the best of the best and they're the nicest people the most talented people in the business so over the years we've developed um, this concert series that features four choral concerts a year and a few organ recitals as well that patrick and i play i just love that time together another one of the great joys i have working here at fifth avenue is with the community choir it's this amazing group of people who get together every week for the sheer love of singing the community choir helps lead music and worship a couple times a month throughout the main season, and we just have a wonderful time together. You know, during the pandemic, we very quickly had to pivot to this virtual choir way of doing things, where the choir and I would go through this very complicated process of recording videos that then we'd have to edit together the sound and the videos and create these virtual choir um, musical offerings for each of the virtual services during the pandemic. And now that we're back in person and doing the live stream thing, that's been a really amazing thing as well to be able to know that we're reaching a really wide audience every week and that there's this wonderful archive of our work online that people can enjoy at any time. The Fifth Avenue community is really special and I feel so honored to be part of it. You know, this affirming and welcoming and friendly and committed community of people who really are trying to make a difference for people in this city. I don't feel like I come to work when I come to the church. I feel like an integral part of this community. I feel like a member. <laughs> and it's such a joy just to be able to come here and spend time and collaborate with such an amazing team of people and such an amazing and generous congregation. It's just, it's just a joy.